Hi, welcome to our check-in. My name is Kelsey. I'm a children's educator here at Lewis Ginter Botanical Garden. And this week we're going to be checking in and talking about oak trees. Does anybody know what kind of seed comes from an oak tree? Hmm. Have you ever seen one of these before? You're right, it's an acorn. Acorns are the seed of an oak tree. If you planted this in the ground, you might get an oak tree to grow. The acorn is made up of the cap, the shell, and the inside, which is the nut or the meaty part that um, animals and humans like to eat. Lots of animals eat acorns. Animals like deer, mice, chipmunks, squirrels, blue jays, wood ducks, turkeys, all kinds of critters love to eat acorns. And Native Americans used to um, depend on acorns and oak trees for their food and for a lot of medicine. The thing that we're gonna make with an acorn today is an acorn ring. As you can see, I have this ring that I made out of an acorn. I'm gonna show you how to do that today. Our first step is to find an acorn that looks like it is big enough and round enough to fit around your finger. Next step is to find a sidewalk with a nice gritty rough texture and the idea is to scratch the top and the bottom of your acorn off and this takes some patience and some serious muscles so this is the hard part and it takes kind of a long time to do That was a lot of work to scratch off the tough outer shell on those two sides of the acorn. The shell will make the ring. So now's the part where we scoop out the nut or kernel on the inside. This is the part that animals and people like to eat. And so once we scoop this out, our ring will be finished. So I used a key to scoop out the inside of my acorn shell. A pencil or a pen, or you, you could even use your fingernail to scrape out the inside. And now I have a beautiful acorn ring. All right, I hope you guys enjoy your new acorn rings. And I hope you guys will tune in for story time on Friday morning with Miss Tarnesia. She'll be reading a story called The Runaway Pumpkin. Thanks, have a good week.